Nobody is going to do Malindi or to improve Malindi or to get tourists to Malindi if you don't do it yourself. The government will take its time. The government will try to do at their own pace. But you are the ones who are going to make the losses every month in, month out. It's you to be innovative. It's you to be resilient. It's you to be more forward thinking about what you are going to do to save your investments. We have done two major studies in the last two years. And now, in the next three months, I'll be rolling out those, those strategies. We have done two studies. One is by, by, uh, by Grand Thornton. Grand Thornton, which have done the best tourism strategy for Southern Africa, for South Africa. We have done one study with Grand Thornton, which identified four, four key things we need to put right. One is product development. And then, this is the product development we are talking about. This has happened here in Malindi. Dickie Evans have done Watamu as Hemingways. Medina Palms is there. So these are new, fresh things which have come into the market. And many will come, I can guarantee you that. That is our first strategy, product development. The second is marketing. And we are changing the entire marketing strategy of the Kenya Tourism Board. I believe they'll come here to talk to you about it. What is happening in Kenya Tourism Board? Then we are putting a strategy for infrastructure. And infrastructure, it talks about roads, networks, and as well as airports. And then the fourth one is investments. I'd like to begin by saying that uh, last year in November, I had a meeting with the Cabinet Secretary for Tourism, the Honorable Nasheed Balala in Malindi, to discuss with what, what we could do to increase the incoming tourism or the cost. I expressed all my concern regarding the difficulties we are facing in getting people to come to Malindi, mainly because of the inadequacy of the logistic infrastructure, such as the only, only road and limitation of the airport. The cabinet secretary responded that the investment necessary to improve the existing infrastructure and tourism for the coastal area is part of the government program for the development of the country.